What's up guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. It is Monday so that means a brand new week and in this tutorial I'm gonna show you guys exactly the best render settings for Vegas Movie Studio 15 Platinum. For everyone that doesn't know I'm giving away two physical copies. I have an update. I received an email this morning saying Alex we will be shipping two physical copies to your home and then you can you can ship them to the winners in about a month, a little bit less than a month from now. So guys it's official. We're giving giving away two physical copies, not like digital serial numbers, physical copies, so you will receive a uh, box straight to your front door, all shipping on my end, so that's really, really amazing. And you guys also have left some awesome comments that you guys want to see the kitten, and as you can see, right here, she is eating, and she has been doing super well. We have her now for a little over a week. She has already grown so much, like she already like, claimed couch and everything, and she is just doing amazing. So guys, make sure to smash the like button down below for this video and I would say let's go to Movie Studio and I'm gonna show you guys the best render settings for YouTube in 1080p resolution. Okay guys, so now that we are in Vegas Movie Studio 15 Platinum, we're gonna run through all the settings you need to know to render this out in the best quality possible. So, what we're gonna do first of all is we're going to go to Media Generators and we're going to drag in a random clip because we also need to adjust two kinds of settings and that is the first one which is the project video properties you want to click on there and you want to put this one the same as your render settings so we're gonna for example pick 1080p obvious and if you want to decide if you want to have regular 1080p or 60 fps what you can do is you can go to the frame rate and you can put this one to 30 or you can put that one to 60 so let's say that we want to render out in 60 fps we're going to put that one to double ntsc right here and we can just go ahead and call this for example 60 fps that's our template and we're going to go ahead and then um, click on this little diskette that icon that's going to save our presets and now we are basically done full resolution render quality you want to put that one to best obviously just click hit save for now and you want to overwrite it and then you can go ahead and click on apply and click on ok so now that we're going to go ahead and uh, render out this clip we're going to select our entire video then what we're going to do is we're going to click on project we are going to go ahead and click on render as and we're going to go ahead and adjust our template right here okay so now we're going to go ahead and go and look at the formats and you're probably wondering which one do we need well we want to just go ahead and pick mp4 so we're going to click on xd cam but i always use sony avc slash mvc but we, you can also pick this one and you can just go ahead and pick 1080p, 1920 by 1080, 30p. Or you can just pick MP4, that's going to be faster and you have the same template, 1920 by 1080. So you can basically decide which one you want to use. I'm going to pick Sony AVC slash MVC. We're going to go ahead and we're going to pick internet 1920 by 1080. We're going to go ahead and click on customize template. And we're going to go ahead and put the frame rates to 60 and we're going to click on project at the bottom and we're going to pick video rendering quality best and we can just call this for example 60 fps so now we're going to click on the disk again icon it's going to save and override it and then we're going to go ahead and click on ok so once we've done that we can pick our template 60 fps at the bottom we can just go ahead and pick the folder where we want to save the project and then we can just you know give it a name for example test render and if we click on render as you can see boom right now it is preparing to render and as you can see it says AAC uh, and then between brackets MC successfully activated we're gonna click on OK and now it is rendering and if you upload it to YouTube it will be 60 FPS and that's how to do it guys this is how you render out your videos in 1080p 30 FPS 60 FPS the whole nine yards and that is it I want to thank you for watching and if you have any additional questions make sure to drop them in the comments down below and I'll be happy to respond to you so that's it and there you go. So guys, that's it. Those are the best render settings for YouTube for 1080p in Vegas Movie Studio 15 Platinum. And like I've said at the beginning, we're giving away two physical copies. Make sure to check out the link in the description. You can find the link there. And as you can see right now, she is just chilling right here on the floor. Hey, she's not really camera shy anymore and she is also just wishing you guys a lot of luck into the giveaway. Who do you think is gonna win? Which country is gonna win? <laughs> so guys, that's it and I will see you guys in a brand new video tomorrow as always on the channel. So I'll catch you guys in tomorrow's video.